Hey Simmers, welcome back to another video. Before we get into today's video, please make sure to subscribe and like for more videos. So today I want to do a challenge, the random number generator challenge. Technically it is, every room is a different budget. So I built this little shell in, in The Sims. It is two bedrooms, um, two and a half bathrooms i want to say i don't know if that'll count as like a half because i only have a toilet in but yeah then then we have a kitchen dining living and an outside patio space that is basically the layout of the house so i have my random number generator over here and i set the minimum for each room 500 and the maximum 10,000. so let's start and spin for the outside okay so this is actually i don't know if it's good or bad we'll see how far this takes us so how much oh wait i need a sim or can i do this let's quickly check three seven six five no we can't we will need a sim so i'll be right back with that there we go i'm back here with a sim let me just quickly get the budget so it was three seven six five simoleons so that we only have that for the entire exterior. So let's get started. So I first want to just adjust roof paint to a dark color. I love this roof paint, it looks so good. But I do want to add some trim, at least all of these things are free, so that is a bonus, thank goodness. Otherwise this would have been very, very expensive. Just want to make this wide as well. There we go. Now, wallpapers, I can't go too expensive, so these are four. Are they cheaper ones? There are these. There are two. I don't really think I would be going for these, but I can't go too expensive. Well, what about brick? These are two, 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 two. All of it is two, except the answer here it's two. So I can use any of these. But I don't really want to. What? How much are the things here? Okay, they are quite expensive. Aren't they like a cool? Wallpaper that I could use. How much are these? Four. Oh my goodness. Can't spend four simoleons on this. I want to go for a dark house. I want to go for like a light house. I don't really like the look of this. Yeah, this is not exactly what I'm going for. So I think I'm going to change it just to this. There we go. So much more plainer. To make sure everything is painted, I don't want to miss a wall. There we go, nice. Okay, so all of that's painted. Then I also don't want to get a brick for the fireplace, so I'm gonna try and tap, um, to go with a quite cheap one. Maybe this. Actually, that might look a bit ugly. Let's quickly see. It doesn't look that bad. Plus, I'm on a budget, so I'm gonna keep it. Then. I do want some columns. I'll extend the roof now because I see it doesn't match. There we go. Then here at the back, I would just want one column over there. Then I do also want stairs. I'll take cheap stairs here because I don't have a lot of money. Two stairs with no underside. More stairs over here. Then I want foundation. Uh, let's maybe get like a nice brick foundation. It's at least free, so we do get some free stuff, which is quite nice. I know it doesn't match that brick now, which is quite sad, but yeah, we're on a budget, so can't go too expensive. Now I want a front door. I really, really want to use this front door, but it's so expensive. Although I think it might be worth it, so I'm going to use it. It's at least not one of these ones that are like very expensive. Then I also want a back door, a door that goes into the backyard. Honestly, the sliding door is actually the perfect fit for here. I don't really know what I'm going for with this room. I want it to be like an outside inside room. So maybe I'll change these walls to half walls. Because I would be getting money back as well. So. Might be doing that and then just like. Do it like, oh my goodness, do it like, oh my goodness. Do it like that. And then just paint these as well. Okay, I like the way this looks. I like it. It's quite nice indoor outdoor space. There we go. 
now um, I might include the wallpaper in this budget. I'll still see how much money I have left at the end. Now I just do want a nice sliding door. These ones are not that expensive for me, Colossal. They are quite cheap, so I might use one of them. I know it doesn't really match the style of the house, but it's got to go with, with what's cheapest. Then I do want a nice archway. The kitchen as well. And I do want some doors, 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 which doors? Uh, maybe these, yeah, I don't want to go for the plain doors, so yeah, maybe then these. We'll need a few of them, though. There we go. That is 100%. Although, if I did put the door here, then I could have a sink and a toilet. If I have enough money, I don't even know how much money I'm going to have for that room. I do want to get, like, a nice big window. That's too big. Wait, why don't I use the Seasons doors and window? This one's really cheap, and these, I know um, the big ones are quite a little bit more expensive, but it's still cheaper than that one. I think I'm going to switch to Seasons, just because of the budget, it's a lot cheaper, so yeah. Yeah, then I can use Seasons doors and windows as well, which is a big save. Let's use this big one. I'll put the stove there, and then the fridge there. Yeah, that'll work. Then here in front, I want a nice big, big window. Because that's like the dining room, so yeah, I want a big window there. Then I do want big windows here on the sides there. So this is starting to look quite nice, and then maybe like a tiny little window over there. I would like a window in there as well. It's because it is quite a dark room. And the art says I could get a bit of a bigger window. Then over here, yeah, let's maybe put a big window over there. It's a big window over there. Plus maybe a big window over there. Medium sized there. Another medium sized. Medium sized. Small window there and small window there. How does this look? Now I don't hate this. I don't hate the way it looks. Although this bedroom I know is there you go. Now there's a bit few more windows for more natural light. Yeah, then this will be the windows of the house. Now, I still want to do some terrain paint. This does not include the backyard. That I'm going to have a separate budget for. But this does include the front patio space. And I'm going to say this little rear patio space, not this space. This is a separate room I'm counting it as. So, then I would want to get some railing over here. Which ones though? These? No. These? No. I feel like these. They are quite expensive. That is 500. I'm going to do it in any case though. I know it is literally all of my budget gone, but yeah. Oh, I still want some landscaping. Oh my goodness. I never factored in that. Although the landscaping doesn't even look good because I just came out of winter. So I'm only going to do this the landscaping for the front because I want to include the back landscaping with the back. And I could get one of these big hedges. These they aren't that expensive with one of these. Maybe they have the end. Uh, should I do one of that? I'm not sure. Maybe these. I need to try and make it look good even if it's not um, destroyed and looks terrible. Even if it's not winter, I still want it to look good. That, I guess. But I do want to do something over here, maybe like a little fern. Let's just actually have one of those within, like... Oh my goodness, I'm running out of money. At least the rain pan is free. I do need a mailbox. So, that is at least also free as well, so... That's quite nice. Although, that is it. I don't think I'll be able to get more than that. Oh, not even a light. Maybe I want to go cheaper somewhere. Do something cheap, at least something. What I want to do, I'm not sure I could do it. It doesn't look like I can go cheaper. So I uh, will just ignore the light and not perform. Now, let's spin for the living room. 8,087 simoleons. I love that. It's a lot of money. We can get a nice TV. 8,087 simoleons. Set it. So let's start with it. By choosing our flooring, I'm obviously going to go just for the cheapest flooring. That's the most optical. 
to you what do you call it? yeah optical i guess fine um then let's also get a nice fireplace because i did the chimney that one's way too modern i really want this one but it's really expensive yes let's just go with this one then that should settle it now let's get some couches as well there we go the living room is finished i do have quite a lot of money too um, I mean to, I mean left over from this, I have nine, any simoleons, but unfortunately I will not be using that, because I'm done with the living room. Now, let's spin for the dining room. 5,483 simoleons. 5,483 simoleons. Set it. There we go. So now I have the amount of money that I need. I, I believe this would be enough. I don't want to change the color of the staircase. I feel like I chose, since I'm going with darker flowing, I want to go with the darker staircase as well. Nice than the walls. Some nice wallpaper in here. Now there we go. I like this. Now let's just first get a light in here. Because I, f I almost forgot about that in the living room. The light. I don't want to put it center in the room, but then... Stairs won't have any light, which needs to be quite dark. But oh well. Now let's just get a table. A nice dining table. So I have a table and some chairs, and I just add like a nice painting over here on this a big empty wall. So I want like a nice big big painting, or maybe just like one of those within like an extra accent table. Which accent table though? I did, did use this one in the living room, but I think I'm going to just use it again. Because it's a nice accent table, so, yeah. So maybe there's something else. I want to put something else in here as well. I don't know what, though, but let's just get some curtains before I forget about that. There we go. So now there are beautiful curtains as well. And maybe a plant. You can never have too many plants in a house. I love them. Where is that plant that I used? Why can't I find it? Oh, here it is. It's just quite expensive plant. So not the most ideal for a challenge where you might not have a lot of money. But yeah, I do have a lot of money for this room. So I'm just going to spend it. There we go. The dining room is finished. I do want to add with the money that I got here. The railing for the stairs. I do want to add that. There we go. Now... On to our next room, which is going to be the tiny little bathroom. We get 2,795 simoleons. 2,795 simoleons. For this tiny little... What? Okay, it's three tile. It's a three tile room. So, for this tiny, tiny, teeny, tiny room. So, we can get actually quite nice expensive tiles. Not that expensive, though. Then some nice wallpaper. I do want to get a nice light in here. Although I feel like for this bathroom, I might just use one of these. Because they're tiny lights. And I just want to get the toilet in here. This is such a small little room. I can hardly work in there. So let's maybe start with the sink. Which sink do I want? I can get quite expensive and expensive sinks. Maybe this one. Um, I can go for quite expensive things here. Maybe I should just get the standard toilet. Okay, yeah, there we go. With a nice mirror. My goodness, it's so small in here. Yeah, I can. I could actually get a nice, quite expensive mirror. So, do I want to? I can get this mirror, but that seems too modern for this house. This house doesn't seem or feel like a modern house. Not this one. It's this one. Yeah, there we go. So that's that little bathroom. Let's maybe just get like a little curtain for it. Wow, I did not use a lot of money in here. And watch the kitchen come, and we get like nothing. Okay, now we are going to be generating for the kitchen day, so thumbs up. Oh my goodness. We got less money for the kitchen than for the tiny three-tile bathroom. How are we going to do a kitchen with 2,631 simoleons? That is... I don't know if we're going to be able to do it. That I, um, I guess we'll see how far we can go, but we'll have to go cheap here. Cheapest everything. There's no room for being expensive. 
Okay, well, I guess let's start. So I don't know if my plan, I'm gonna, my plan is going to work, what I don't want to do. Because we'll have to go... I'm going to try and go for these counters. Otherwise, if I can't, I'm going to delete them and just go for the cheaper ones. Should we go for just like a plain white kitchen? I think so. But yeah, this was my original kitchen idea. I don't know if it'll work since we have almost no money right now. I do hope that it will because it's, I think it's a good idea. But yeah, so I'm going to start with this fridge. I don't want to go cheapest yet. I'm going to start with this oven. Yeah, we're not going to make it. I'm going to have to go with the cheapest appliances. So the used one, which does not look very pretty at all. But yeah, that it is what it is. This is not going to be the best room in the house. We do also need a trash can and a sink. So yeah, I don't see this room being the best room in the house. So I can go for quite an expensive sink. But I think I'll go for a cheaper sink and get some upper cabinets. Perhaps. Some nice upper cabinets. There we go. Some nice upper cabinets. And then I also do need a light. I think that'll basically be it for this room. I can get nice lights, so that's quite exciting. Although now I'm broke. So that is our kitchen, which was the cheap kitchen. Cheap kitchen. Now, for the hallway upstairs, how many how much money are we gonna get for that? 1248 simoleons. Well that is really little. That is really, really little. And I'm not excited about this. Not the best amount we could have gotten, we could have gotten a lot more. I wish we did. Because I do not know how I'm going to do a hallway that is actually quite a good size. With only that little bit of money. I'm going to have to go for cheap lights on this one. There we go. Oh, I still need to do the rating as well. Yeah, um, this is very expensive. For the amount of money that I have. Because I do not have a lot of money. Not at all. I would like to get a desk here, but it doesn't seem light enough. So, a desk with absolutely no computer on it, because, you know, we don't have the money for it, but I just want to get something, at least, in this room. So that'll be a... Well, that'll be all we'll put there. Then maybe a bookshelf. Maybe I'll be able to get one. Oh, I can actually get a few. That one seems too big for this house. Um, no, not that one. Maybe this one. Yeah, let's maybe just go with this one. And now we are almost like literally broke. Let's just get like a last decoration, maybe a painting on the wall or something. Whoa, that's too expensive. Oh my goodness. What painting should I go for? There's not really a lot of options. Maybe I should just size that up and go with that one. There we go. This is our sad little hallway. Then for this bathroom, we will... Get 8,104. Couldn't we have got enough for the kitchen? Okay, that's a lot of money for a bathroom. But I, I guess um, they wanted us to have a lot of money for the bathroom. So I went for quite a similar look than downstairs bathroom with the same toilet, the same sink, same mirror. But we still have a lot of money left, although I can't really put more into that bathroom. So onto the child's room or second bedroom. We only get 2,988. Couldn't we have gotten this for the bathroom? 2,988. That is so much money for a kid's bedroom. So I guess it's just continue with the flooring. Just continue with the walls. Let's maybe make like a green sort of color. Let's just get in like a light. Perhaps. There we go. So here I spent almost all of the money. I do have a bit left. But this is the kitty's bedroom that I made. Now for the main bedroom. How much are we going to get for the main bedroom? 5,688. 5,688. There we go. So I can just continue the flooring. This is not too bad. It is quite a big room, so it might not be enough, but or it might be more than enough. <laughs> Depends. So I will get two lights in here really brighten up the parents bedroom although I did not think the layout of this bedroom through really because um I, okay it is quite a big bedroom it is a quite a very big bedroom 
I can't go for that expensive of a bed because I don't have that kind of money. But I can at least get a decent bed. It's quite a nice bed, actually. I do have to say. It is quite a nice bedroom. There we go. The parents' bedroom is done. I do still have a bit of money left. So now let's spend for the last bathroom. Here we get 5,478 simoleons. 5,478 uh, simoleons. Can't give myself an extra simoleon. And there we go. The last room is done. I still do have a little bit of money left. But I did do the bathroom. So now for this outside patio space. Let's generate a random number for that. Hopefully we'll get a good amount. 4,888 simoleons. 4,888. Also, I decided that the money at the first that we got first also counted for the backyard. So we are basically going to have nothing in the backyard. <laughs> it's quite sad. But yeah, now we yeah, do have the brick pavers. There we go. There we go. Right, so now the wallpaper matches. Now let's just get like a cool outdoor light. Because I want to make this like a cool outside barbecue space area. So appliances, let's go get a grill. Nice big fancy grill. Okay, that was quite really expensive. I don't know why I spent that much on a grill. Then we also want a nice table for the exterior space. Where are those tables? Okay, here they are. Let's get this one. A bit more oldish. Then, this, what do I, I want? Oh, we, right, a trash can. We're going to get a big trash can, which we'll put over there. Now, let's maybe get some outdoor activities to do while you are out here. Although, maybe a stereo would be a good thing to have outside here. So, let's maybe get one of those. We could actually get like a quite nice, expensive one. There we go. And what else? What else do we want to get out here? Huh. I just don't know. Maybe some plants. That could work. Let's just get like a little one in the middle of the table and then a bigger one next to the grill. Then maybe. Well, you do have the big trash can, so I'm, I wanted to put a small one, but I'm not going to. Then maybe. What do I want to put down here? I want something else. Can't find something else though. Maybe just like an outdoorsy chair, maybe. Although, where do I want to put this? Just like that, yeah, just like that. There we go. You have an outdoorsy chair. So there is our every room is a different budget house challenge. Well, challenge house. <laughs> I mean, this house altogether costs. That's not true. I'll. Let's quickly make sure how much it actually costs. So the house actually costs about 44,000 a month, which is quite actually a lot. It is two bedrooms and two and a half bathrooms, which is quite nice. It's quite roomy on the inside. Plus it has this big outside space here at the back. There is no backyard because there was no money for a backyard. There is a bit of plants in the front yard so i mean i guess that's it there's nothing on your porch which is quite sad but yeah so this is the house so thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope you guys enjoyed it and see you guys on my next video bye guys